Good morning everyone. I hope all of you are doing well. I am Harshit Saxena and today we are going to learn about nouns. We are going to learn about what a noun is and what are the types of nouns. So, what is a noun? A noun is a word that names something. It is a naming word. So what what can we name? We can name a person like all of us. All of us are persons, right? We can name places, our city, our school, a hospital. We can name things, board, table, marker. All of these are things. So can you give me some examples of persons? Yes, I I am a person, my name is a noun, your, all of your names are nouns, Ravi, Riya, Sumit, all of our names are nouns, then places, our city, Pune, our country, India, right? city, country. Now, thing. Marker, as I said. A board. These are things. So, noun is a naming word and it can name a person, a place or a thing. Now what are the different types of nouns? There are many different types of nouns. But today we are going to learn about the main three types of nouns which are proper, common and abstract. Abstract. So what are proper nouns? A proper noun is a noun, is a word which names something unique. <coughs> it names something particular. Like all of us have different names. So all of our names are proper nouns. Taj Mahal. Taj Mahal is unique. Pune. India. All of these are unique. So these are proper nouns. Then common noun. A common noun is a noun, is a word which is used to name a group, a group of similar things. For example, building. <clears throat> Taj Mahal is also a building. Our hospital is also a building. But when it has a different name, it becomes a proper noun and when we say it's a building or it's a city it becomes a common noun because there are many cities Pune is only one of cities Pune, Mumbai is also a city Delhi is also a city then abstract nouns abstract nouns are those nouns which are used to refer to things which we cannot see which we cannot touch which we cannot hear but we can feel for example what can we feel? We can feel happiness. We can feel sadness. We can feel pain. Now all of these things, happiness, sadness, pain, we cannot touch, we cannot see, but we can feel. So all of these words are nouns, are abstract nouns, because they are Referring to something which we cannot touch or see but we can feel. So today what have we covered? We have covered what a noun is. That it names a person, a place or a thing. And the different types of nouns which are proper nouns naming something unique. Common nouns which name a group. And abstract nouns like happiness, sadness and pain which we are used, which we use to name things we cannot touch or see or feel. Thank you.